I've got some good news for DJI Mini 3 Pro owners that have this controller. It seems DJI have provided a fix uh, to fix what they broke in the last update, which was a fix uh, for things that needed fixing. So has this actually worked? Well, I'm going to discuss and show you exactly what they have done and what they've fixed in this video. So let's get into it. So as per the last firmware update, this is just the RC controller firmware um, alone. Uh, so we can go put the drone to the side. So what exactly have DJI fixed in with this new update? Well, as you can see, if I pop the release notes on the screen, this is all to do with the compass and the fact that the compass was not displaying correctly for some users. I would say it was some users, but from what I saw, it was actually the majority of users where basically uh, the compass was just dancing around all over the place. Um, I suffered this myself when I was doing a bit of a range test, which you can see uh, on screen now. Okay, and I've just had the drone up uh, flying it uh, just to show you this um, on the old firmware which ends in 0100 and as you can see um, as I'm flying around the compass is just dancing around completely uh, the compass indicator or the direction indicator is completely off okay so really not usable now one major thing that I do not like about this um, controller okay and it is actually down to the compass calibration you see if I bring up the compass menu or the compass where we can calibrate this controller unfortunately as we look down at the bottom where it says the compass is normal unless there is an actual um, indication via the controller that the compass accuracy is actually low it will not start the compass calibration the minute we click the button to start the calibration it just says it is done and this is a feature I hope DJI will add at some point where well, they will just like the you can with the drone where you can manually uh, force it through and it will calibrate and um, hopefully they will add the feature so when we do actually uh, want to calibrate the compass whether it's low or normal it will actually do that but anyway you know DJI have given us this update so let's go ahead and just test it then so first of all we need to install the update it's only going to take around five minutes depend on the speed of your internet connection um, now of course as I've mentioned that this is just a control update there's no uh, new DJI flight apps and no new options in menus or anything like that there's no uh, more features for the drone it is literally just supposedly to fix this compass so let's put the drone up in the air then and just take a quick look and as you can see I'm pleased to report that as I'm flying around the compass direction indicator is working exactly as it should if I move my body to the left and to the right it does display that green indicator which highlights whether you are pointing the controller towards the drone efficiently for the strongest signal. Um, however, if we do flick into the menus, like I've just mentioned about the whole calibration thing, even with this new firmware update for this, and um, because my compass is showing as normal, it will not allow me to manually calibrate it. So yeah, just to repeat myself, I hope that's a feature DJI will add in the future. Um, but overall, uh, this is you know quite a short video because ultimately, DJI have said that they've fixed the compass. As you can see, I've put the drone up in the air and I can confirm that this firmware update has fixed the compass. Um, so for those of you that were having problems, you can see that this is now displaying correctly. And just a quick one, just to add in to this video, if you do ever find yourself uh, in a situation where the compass isn't quite working as it should, one of the best features of the DJI Fly app is if we click into the maps, okay, it doesn't matter where you are, you can see that if we look at this orange or red line, depending on your eyesight and screen color, that will always show you uh, the quickest way to return home safely so all you need to do is open up your map and then just fly your drone in the direction and um, follow this orange line and you will always get back home even if the compass isn't quite working so that was quite a short one um, because it seems that DJI have been quite successful in doing what they set out to do and they have fixed the compass on this RC controller. Of course, if you are using the DJI Fly app on an iOS or Android device, it doesn't affect you. That was working absolutely fine. It is just this combination right here. But if you want to see what range test I was doing with the DJI Mini 3 Pro um, and actually using this controller, I will leave a link to the video that I was filming when you can see my compass wasn't quite working correctly and go check it out it's quite an interesting one until next time thank you very much for watching don't forget to hit that thumbs up consider subscribing if you're awesome until next time see you again soon